This edition of the Mike Wagner Show is brought to you by Picture This Photo Books, where remembering is the key ingredient. How beautiful your mother looked at her wedding, and even more so at yours. And who doesn't miss grandma's meatballs? The holidays are coming. What better time to give a gift of remembrance that makes you laugh and cry all at the same time? Whatever gift of grandma's recipes, or just because, those smiles and tears will melt your heart. Call Karen Shaw at 646-798-0809 or visit picturethisphotobooks.com. Mention the Mike Wagner Show and get 10% off your first order. Picture This Photo Books, bringing your memories back to life. The whimsical, casual, or formal, and always uniquely you. The Mike Wagner Show is powered by Sonic Web Studios. If you're looking to start or upgrade your online presence, visit www.sonicwebstudios.com for all of your online needs. Call 1-800-303-3960 or visit us online at www.sonicwebstudios.com to get started today. Mention the Mike Wagner Show and get 20% off your project. Sonic Web Studios, take your image to the next level. Hey everybody, it's Mike from the Mike Wagner Show. It's time to give a shout out to our official sponsor of the Mike Wagner Show, international award-winning author Mian Mosin Zia. If you love fast-paced mysteries, then you'll love Missing by Mian Mosin Zia. Available on Amazon in paperback and ebook. Missing is fast-paced and intriguing with an unforgettable twist. It takes place in four countries with two strangers and one target where truth is an illusion and those you love will be the first to go missing. It's available in paperback and ebook on Amazon. Missing by Mian Mosin Zia has garnered great reviews and is even loved by Hollywood celebrities, including Joanna Cassidy, Forbes Riley, and many others. So grab your copy today. Order Missing by Mian Mosin Zia. Now available at Amazon. It's now time for the Mike Wagner Show, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. The Mike Wagner Show can be heard on Spreaker, Spotify, iHeartRadio, YouTube, iTunes, Anchor FM, Radio Public, and themikewagnershow.com. Mike brings you great guests and interesting people from all across the globe. So sit back, relax, and enjoy another great episode of the Mike Wagner Show. Hey everybody, it's Mike from the Mike Widener Show, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. Look at a professional website without breaking your budget. Sonic Web Studios is the answer. Sonic Web Studios offers fast, affordable custom web designs that blow the competition away. Call today, 1-800-303-3960. That's 1-800-303-3960. Or email to support at sonicwebstudios.com. Mention the Mike Widener Show, get 20% off your first project. Sonic Web Studios, take your image to the next level. Also, time to give official shout out to our official sponsor of the Mike Widener Show, international war ring author Mia Molson Dia. If you love fast paced mysteries, you love Missing by Mia Molson Dia, available on Amazon in paperback and ebook. Missing is fast paced and intriguing with an unforgettable twist. It takes place in four countries, two strangers, one target, where truth is an illusion and those you love be the first to go missing. It's available on Amazon in paperback and ebook. Missing by Mia Molson Dia has garnered great reviews. In Eve Love and Enjoys by Howard Celebrities, including Joanna Cassie, Forge Riley, and Manilas. So grab your copy today, Four Girls Missing by Mia Molson Zio, available on Amazon. Also, the Mike Widener Show is brought to you by Picture This Photo Books, where remembering is the key ingredient. How beautiful your mother looked at a wedding, and even more so it's yours. Who doesn't miss Grandma's meatballs, huh? Well, the holidays are coming. What better time to give a gift for remembrance that makes you laugh and cry all at the same time? What if a gift for Grandma's recipes or just because? Those smiles and tears will just melt your heart. Call Karen Shaw. Picture This Photo Books at 646-798-0809 or visit picturethisphotobooks.com. Mention Mike Widener's show. Get 10% off your first order. Picture this photo books, bring your memories back to life. The whimsical, casual, or formal, and always uniquely you. Also, check out the Mike Widener Show at themikewidenershow.com and all of our 30 podcast platforms, including Facebook, Spreaker, Spotify, Anchor FM, iHeartRadio, and more. Take the Mike Widener Show with you on any mobile device. Subscribe to the Mike Widener Show on the YouTube channel. And don't forget to follow the Mike Widener Show on Instagram and Twitter today. And check out the Mike Widener Show merchandise 24-7, 365 at themikewidenershow.com and also on amazon.com at the Mike Widener Show podcast. T-shirts, pop sockets, throw pillows, tote bags makes great gifts year-round. And don't forget to tell friends to do so and uh, get a jump on shopping. And for more great gift ideas, go to Amazon.com and check out the Me and Molson Zia store for great books like Missing, Ones, Wrinkles, and cool merchandise like T-shirts, pop sockets, hoodies, and all kinds. 
And don't forget to uh, donate generously to the Mike Widener Show at themikewidenershow.com. Also support us on Anchor FM slash support and PayPal at the Mike Widener Show or Mike Widener VoiceOver. Make sure you do so today. We're here with a terrific gentleman who is an award-winning singer, songwriter, and actor-performer, as well as a writer and an LGBTQ advocate or activist and a motivational speaker. This guy is terrific. He began his career at the age of 13 and featured on Grammy.com, also Rolling Stone Magazine, Billboard, New York Times, BuzzFeed, Al- Alternate Press, American Songwriter, and more. He's uh, logged in over 600 performances so far, including the Vance Warp Tour, the Lincoln Center, Oregon Shakespeare Fest, and also South by Southwest. And he also and a multi-award uh, winner as well, too, including the Harvey Milk Memorial Award, Best Breakout Performance, and um, also featuring in uh, some award-winning films, uh, no documentary uh, songs for Alexis. And he's also an advocate and... Um, a speaker for the LGBTQ community as well, too. He's got a great story to share. And, and what else, by the way, we'll be featuring his uh, brand new release, Guard Rail, from the uh, Magic Miracle Mile release. That's coming out as well, too. We'll be playing that. Live, ladies and gentlemen, from the Plus Studios in beautiful downtown Los Angeles, going from coast to coast, from Long Island to uh, L.A. as well. Ladies and gentlemen, the very multi-talented Ryan Casada. Ryan, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Thanks for joining us today. Thanks so much for having me on. Well, it's great to have you on board, Ryan. I mean, I read your story and it's just amazing. We love to hear more. You're an award-winning singer-songwriter as well as an actor, performer, and a writer, LGBTQ activist, and motivational speaker. I mean, you got a terrific story. We'd like to have you um, share about that. You began a career at the age of 13 and you're featured on Grammy.com, Rolling Stone, Billboard, New York Times, and more. You've logged in over 600 performances so far, which is just amazing, including the Vans Warp Tour, South by Southwest, and Lincoln Center. And you also have a multi-war winner as well, too. You also were featured in some films. You acted in Two Eyes and songs for Alexis, and uh, you also had an anti-bullying message. I mean, you've got a great thing going. And before getting on it, Ryan, tell us how I first got started. Yeah, I mean, first got started, um, that would just have to be my love for music, which started very young. Um, around age six is when I first picked up a guitar, and mm-hmm. now it's been, you know, two decades of just playing music, and um, that led to everything everything else really, but music was the thing that started my uh, career in in the spotlight. And, um, you know, music is still my, like my everything. Mm -hmm. What got your first interest in the guitar starting at six? What got you first interested? Yeah. My older brother was actually kind of playing guitar and then he ended up not really playing it. So I was like sitting in the corner and I would just be looking at it and I was like, I really want to play guitar. And I just had this thing inside of me where I just really wanted to play play. And I kept begging my parents for lessons. And um, a few years after that, I started writing songs. So it all just fell into place. Yeah. That was amazing. And did your brother mind if you uh, got got the guitar from him or did you have to beat him up or he had to get through? He's like, (laughs) no, no, no. no." (laughs) Well, actually, I was very, very small as a kid. So that guitar was like probably taller than than I was standing. So <laughs> they actually had to make a tiny guitar for me. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I kind of figure this too, like with, um, you know, wanting that guitar. So it's like, here, I'll let you have this uh, baseball hat. Here, I'll let you have some candy bars. You can have my glove, but here, can I have your guitar? It's like, it's very typical. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And uh, what was that one precise moment that simply influenced you into what you're doing for the rest of your life? So in other words, what was that one moment that said, this is it for me? Yeah, I think um, it was when I was I was 12 years old and my guitar teacher asked me, is this going to be your hobby or your passion? And that I think that was the moment where I was like, oh, like I could do this, Mm. you know? Wow. He must have put you on the spot right away. And sounds like you made a really good choice. Yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. That is amazing as well, too. And who are some of your favorite um, artists, singers, songwriters um, growing up? Growing up, it was all about classic rock, really. Um, Led Zeppelin, Bruce Springsteen, Billy Joel. Uh, that was all in, in my house on, on the classic rock radio station. Um, there's Cher- Cheryl Crow was on there. So a lot of like classic rock. And then... Um, Shifting into my teenage years, I got into punk rock a lot. 
And now I really listen to everything, but you know, those genres in the beginning really influence your, your songwriting and, and my early songwriting. So hmm. that's rather interesting as well, too. We'll talk about um, your latest guardrail along with the uh, mattress from the magic um, miracle mile. You also had Jupiter daughter rebels and ghosts and more. We'll also talk about um, your words, your career and your activism. But first you listen to the Mike Widener show at the Mike Widener show.com powered by Soundcraft studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. Look at a professional website without breaking your budget. Sonic Web Studios is the answer. Sonic Web Studios offers fast, affordable custom web designs that blow the competition away. Call today, 1-800-303-3960. It's 1-800-303-3960. Or email to support at sonicwebstudios.com. Mention the Mike Widener Show. Get 20% off your first project. Sonic Web Studios, take your image to the next level. Also, time to give official shout out to our official sponsor of the Mike Wagner Show, international warring author Mia Molsonzia. If you love fast paced mysteries, you'll love Missing by Mia Molsonzia, available on Amazon in paperback and ebook. Missing is fast paced and intriguing with an unforgettable twist. It takes place in four countries, two strangers, one target, where truth is an illusion and those you love be the first to go missing. It's available on Amazon in paperback and ebook. Missing by Mia Molson Zia has garnered great reviews in Eve Love and endorsed by Howard celebrities, including Joanna Cassie, Forge Riley, and many others. So grab your copy today for Girls Missing by Mia Molson Zia, available on Amazon. Also, the Mike Wagner Show is brought to you by Picture This Photo Books, where remembering is the key ingredient. How beautiful your mother looked at a wedding, and even more so at yours. And who doesn't miss grandma's meatballs, huh? Well, the holidays are coming. What better time to give a gift for memories that makes you laugh and cry all at the same time? Whatever gift for grandma's recipes or just because... Those smiles and tears will just melt your heart. Call Karen Shaw at Picture This Photo Books at 646-798-0809 or visit PictureThisPhotoBooks.com. Mention the Mike Widener Show. Get 10% off your first order. Picture This Photo Books. Bring your memories back to life. The whimsical, casual, or formal, and always uniquely you. And don't forget to check out the Mike Widener Show at themikewidenershow.com and over 30 podcast platforms. Take the Mike Widener Show with you on any mobile device. Subscribe to the Mike Widener Show on the YouTube channel. Follow the Mike Widener Show on Instagram and Twitter today. And check out the Mike Widener Show merchandise at themikewidenershow.com and also on Amazon at the Mike Widener Show podcast. And for more great gift ideas, go to amazon.com. Check out the Me and Molson Zia store for great books and merchandise. Amazon.com slash Me and Molson Zia store. And don't forget to um, support the Mike Widener Show on Anchor FM as well as PayPal and the Mike Widener Show.com. Make sure you give generously today. We're here with the award winning singer, songwriter, actor, performer, and writer, LGBTQ activist, and motivational speaker, Ryan Casada, here on the Mike Wagner Show. And before we talk about some of your music, including um, Guardrail and Mattress from your Magic uh, Miracle Mile release, and um, you, you got some great stuff. We'll be playing that. Um, you also did some acting as well, too. You were in Two Eyes and Songs for Alexis. You also were involved in the soundtrack. And uh, tell us a bit about um, acting in those films. Yeah, I love acting. Um, Two Eyes was the most recent film I was in, which will be rolling out soon. And that one, I play a young, troubled teenager. Um, and it takes place in Wyoming. It was it was really beautiful. Um, mm. And it's it's really like an artsy film that is a it's a coming of age story, and it's a lot about the LGBTQ community and gender identity and expression. And I think it's, it's going to help a lot of people when they see it and just acting. And it was, it, it was a, just a great experience. I loved being on set and I loved working alongside Kate Bornstein, who is a really legendary trans activist. Hmm. So it was great to work alongside her and just be part of, of two eyes, which I, I would say is a really magical film. And it was a magical time on set as well. So I'm really looking forward to the world seeing it. Mm -hmm. And not only that, you also had songs for Alexis as well too. And you also were responsible for a song track and uh, tell us a bit about that. Yeah. Songs for Alexis is a documentary. So for like six months, I was followed by cameras when I was um, 18 years old. And wow. yeah, so the, the music that's in that film was like written as we were going and some of that movie actually films me writing as well so hmm. that's really interesting as well i thought they were stalking you like cameras you know this was we're gonna put it on facebook so <laughs> uh. and of course you know you know speaking about the lgbtq um you know involvement as well too you started 
as an activist at 13 years old, joined the Safe School team. And uh, you're also um, accomplished as the youngest keynote speaker in Philadelphia. And uh, tell us about uh, how you got started being as an activist. Yeah, um, I started really because I was being bullied at, at school and um, I didn't want anyone to feel alone like I did. I didn't want anyone to feel isolated like that. So I started instead of like fighting back with violence, I, I decided, you know what, I'm going to fight back with education mm. and, you know, use educational words and dialogue and engage with people in this different way. So maybe their their hearts and their minds could open up to understanding. So that was my my tactic. And um, I started speaking at schools um, really young because I joined the safe schools team at the Long Island Gay and Lesbian Youth Center. And then eventually I was getting called to speak on my own, which led me to being the youngest uh, keynote speaker at the Philadelphia Trans Health Conference. And I was also on Larry King live when I was 15 and the Tyre Banks show when I was uh, 17. Wow, that is amazing. Going through all that, you know, being at such an age as well, too, where most people are pretty shy about it. And um, what are some of the subjective messages, you know, yet that you uh, talk about at most of your speeches as well, too, besides LGBTQ, like, you know, like some of the things besides the acceptance and everything else. What are some of the issues um, that you also cover and also uh, that branch out of it? Yeah, I mean, I talk a lot about about bullying and why we need to support each other and how to be better allies and that we, you know, need to listen to each other to understand each other. And sometimes that means, you know, shutting your mouth and just listening and not, not speaking for a little while and just talk and just listening so that we can understand each other. Mm -hmm. And and also too, that uh, you also been in uh, 600 performances as well too, you you know, going from public speaking back over the singing and um, you had 600 performances, which is amazing. You're in the band's work tour. You're in South by Southwest, Lincoln Center and Oregon Shakespeare Fest. Tell us a bit about that. And if there are some other fests that you have performed in as well too, and uh, feel free to talk about those as well. Yeah. I I mean, I love performing. I've been doing it since I was very young and it's that started with basically with open mics and then playing um little bar shows and club shows on long island where i'm from we had a pretty vibrant music scene there was like shows pretty much every weekend on long island and that's what i did um and before i had my license my mom my dad would just drive me around and do open mics and play shows. And then it just started branching out when I was in my late teens and I got to start playing in other states and being flown places to play and speak. So it all just, you know, one thing kind of led to another, a lot of hard work, a lot of uh, dedication. So it's not, you know, it's not like it was, it was just uh, like magic that it all happens. Like it was a lot of hard work. And Mm -hmm. I mean, when I was 15, years old, I called like, made like 500 phone calls and emails to book my first tour. That was like a week long, not even. So um, it's a lot of work that goes into this. Hmm. It sounds like a lot of work. You're doing a great job of it, Ryan. And tell us about your journey going from Long Island to Los Angeles, where you're currently at right now. Yeah, LA, um, it's the place to be for the industry. I love it here. Um, Long Island, I would say is still like pretty conservative and there's not much to do there, especially not much entertainment wise. So um, as far as being in the industry is concerned. So I'm, I'm really glad that um, I made it to, to L.A. and I live here in the city because this really is the city of dreams and, and opportunities like, you know, people come here to chase their dreams. And I feel lucky to be part of that. Mm-hmm. And speaking of chasing dreams, you're really successful with some music as well, too. You previously released uh, Jupiter, Daughter, Rebels and Ghosts, The Witches, uh, Made Me Do It, Shine. And uh, tell us about your uh, previous songs and albums. And if you got any other music in the pipeline as well, too, if we haven't mentioned, feel free to talk about it as well. I would say I'm just a songwriting machine. Like, I haven't been able to stop writing songs. I mean, if I go like a month without writing a song, I feel pretty weird inside so like that kind of tells you that i write like at least one album a year so i've been able to release a lot of albums so far in my career and there's definitely more coming the songs just don't stop and (laughs) it's a blessing so Mm -hmm. it's fun you know it's a great expression and it sounds like a lot of fun too and uh 
What what do you what do you base your music on in terms of your lyrics? Yeah, I mean, all my, all my lyrics really are from my real life. Like it's all inspiration. It's the things that I go through. It's the things I witness. The things I come across. Like it's you know, it um, it's just my experiences. It's my real life. It's from from the heart for real. Hmm. It sounds like it as well, too. And we're going to be playing uh, Guardrail from the Magic Miracle Mile release. From Ryan Casado will play Guardrail in just one minute. You listen to the Mike Widener Show at the themikewidenershow.com, powered by SoundCloud Studios. Visit online at soundcloudstudios.com for all your needs. Also brought to you by official sponsor of the Mike Widener Show, international warring author Mia Molson Zia Missing, available on Amazon in paperback and ebook. Also brought to you by a picture of this photo book. Remembering is a key ingredient. Call Karen Shaw at 646-798-0809 or visit pictureofthisphotobooks.com. We'll be back with the multi-talented Ryan Casada with Guardrail after this time out. This edition of the Mike Wagner Show is brought to you by Picture of This Photo Books, where remembering is the key ingredient. How beautiful your mother looked at her wedding, and even more so at yours. And who doesn't miss grandma's meatballs? The holidays are coming. What better time to give a gift of remembrance that makes you laugh and cry all at the same time? Whatever gift of grandma's recipes, or just because, those smiles and tears will melt your heart. Call Karen Shaw at 646-798-0809 or visit picturethisphotobooks.com. Mention the Mike Wagner Show and get 10% off your first order. Picture this photo books, bringing your memories back to life. They're whimsical, casual, or formal, and always uniquely you. The Mike Wagner Show is powered by Sonic Web Studios. If you're looking to start or upgrade your online presence, visit www.sonicwebstudios.com for all of your online needs. Call 1-800-303-3960 or visit us online at www.sonicwebstudios.com to get started today. Mention The Mike Wagner Show and get 20% off your project. Sonic Web Studios, take your image to the next level. Hey everybody, my name is Forbes Riley and I'm an American actress and a TV host. And I was delighted when I got my copy of Missing, which is Extraordinary Relation of Ordinary People based on a real life relationship. It's just, it's well written, it's amazing. You know, it talks about a man who has lost his wife and his daughter, and it's very well done. I'm gonna highly recommend that you go get your copy of Missing. It is a powerful, exciting read. Mr. Mian Moshe Zia, he is the author of Missing. And I wanna give a big shout out and a kiss all the way halfway around the world to my dear friend. Check him out at Mia's website. It's called www.miamotionzea.com. Missing, available on Amazon. Again, I'm Forbes Riley and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye. Hey, hey, this is Ray Powers. And if there's one thing you can count on in these unpredictable times, it's that you're in good hands getting some great radio, courtesy of the Mike Wagner Show. That's okay. I'm not We're back with multi-talented and award-winning singer, songwriter, actor, performer, and writer, LGBTQ advocate, and motivational speaker, um, Ryan Casada here on the Mike Wagner Show. Right now, here's his latest from Magic Miracle Michael. Mile. Here's Guardrail from Ryan Casada right here on the Mike Wagner Show. Two weeks without talk Felt close to the end like Montauk Said I'd drive over the guardrail for you Crash my car into the ocean after a fit and an anger explosion. Said I wouldn't come up for air. Told you that I didn't care. No, that's not true. Just wanted you closer. Still looking in the rear view. So sorry that I scared you. I know I get real twisted in the head sometimes. It's true. Wondering how I get on without you. All I see is black and dark blue Baby girl always came to the rescue Crying on the floor in the bathroom Said you can't play this anymore Go and fight your own war So I sink deep Wrestling in my sleep My talk is cheap You better go on without me I'll light the candle up when you call me back too much to handle 
But don't say you don't want me back, girl Baby, I'm sinking Got me wishing, wishful thinking Oh, no Baby, I'm sinking Wishful think Don't say you don't want me back Great song, Ryan Casada. That was Guardrail here on the Mike Wagner Show. Tell us more about that great song, Guardrail, and what inspired you to write it. Yeah, those those songs are really they're this whole record is like breakup music, breakup album, but it's also about like self empowerment and and moving on and and knowing that you know you deserve better. So I hope that even though it is like they are sad sad songs that people find them empowering and it helps it helps them in some way mm-hmm. and also have mattress as well too we plan at the end of the show and uh tell us more about that Matt, song mattress what inspired you to write it yeah same same thing as guardrail really you know breakup song it's about just feeling lonely and um trying to cope i mean i wrote this record during the pandemic most of it i wrote during the early shelter in place so it was a very isolating time and I think, you know, everybody went through that at the same time and we all had our, our struggle with that. So I think it will be relatable for all. Mm-hmm. Do you feel you got more accomplished during the pandemic or did you wish you, uh, you, you did more? You just kind of cut back. Yeah, I mean, I probably did more. I wish that I was able to go out on tour and I missed doing live shows for sure. But I did produce a lot of music and I self-produced and self-recorded and I definitely expanded a lot with my my vocals and with my instrumentation and all of that. And I and I started learning how to play the drums, too. So and the bass. Oh, my gosh. Wow. You're going to be like the next. uh, Who who is that? Bruno Mars, who does everything (laughs) all together. Oh, my gosh. I'm happy for you. (laughs) Thank you. (laughs) And where can we find uh, Magic Miracle Mile, Guardrail, Mattress and all your uh, music at, Ryan? Where can we find it? Yeah. Magic Miracle Mile. The record is coming on October 22nd and the songs uh there's four songs out from that record right now and you could find them on Spotify, iTunes, Apple, Pandora, Deezer, all the everything YouTube too so um please yeah please go listen and support we certainly want to check that out. We're here with uh, the multi-talented Ryan Casada here on the Mike Wagner Show in just a few more minutes. We'd love you back on in 2021 and beyond. You've been absolutely fantastic. Um, what else can we expect from you in 2021 and beyond, Ryan? Thank you so much. Yeah, uh, I'll wrap up the rest of this year with some shows. The record's going to drop, and more music is definitely coming. So I'll mm-hmm. keep on releasing. And we're looking forward as well, too. And who do you consider your biggest influence in a career? Um, I would say probably Bruce Springsteen, to be honest. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And what's the best advice you can give to anybody at this point? The best advice I can give is to be yourself. You know, that's all you can be. So be yourself. Don't don't act like anyone else and just do what feels best for you and what makes you happy. At a very good point as well, too. Once again, award-winning singer, songwriter, actor, performer, the multi-talented Ryan Casada here on the Mike Wagner Show. Ryan, a very big thank you for your time. You've been absolutely fantastic. Looking forward to having you again soon. Do us a favor. Keep us up to date. Love you back in 2021 and beyond. Don't forget to keep in touch. Once again, tell us about your upcoming projects, what's your website, how do people contact you, where can people purchase or check out your music? 
Thanks so much. You can check everything out at ryanquesada.com. And you can find me on Spotify, Apple Music, YouTube, Pandora, all the social media. Uh, just search Ryan Casada. I think I'm the only Ryan Casada in the country. So <laughs> <laughs> I, I wish I had that last name. Mine be a lot easy. You're lucky. <laughs> 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 we'll certainly check you out once again, Ryan. A big thank you for your time. You've been absolutely amazing. Looking forward to having you again soon. Do us a favor, keep yourself to date. We love to have you back in 2021 beyond. Don't forget to keep in touch. You've been absolutely terrific. And we definitely wish you all the best. you got. Great future ahead of you. Thank you so much. I don't mind you on my matches. Overrated the day after. Chasing in my hair one time in my bed. Kinda like it if you leave me on red. I don't mind you on my matches. Overrated the day after. Chasing in my hair one time in my bed. I kinda like it if you leave me on red. I'm sick of it, only I'm fucking lonely. I'm in the what now? Figure it out now Impulse for downtown Full of regret Wow Bad taste in my mouth Real quick we go south Kinda like it if you leave me on red Kinda like it if you leave me upset If you're unavailable That's better It's just the idea of us being together Chanel on my face and Gucci on my waist I blow my money now trying to escape Find every reason to cut the red tape I'm on my own now and I'm fucking insane I don't mind you on my mattress Over it the day after Chasing in my head one time in my bed I kinda like it if you leave me on red I don't mind you on my mattress Over it the day after Chasing in my head one time in my bed if you leave me on Scared of romance and dancing with a girlfriend I miss my last ex, her Lambo and her black dress I'm in the deep end, I only pretend I'll write you in in black pen, just to cross you out again Kinda like it if you leave me on red Kinda like it if I'm your regret We can fuck around for a day or two I promise that you won't be my breakthrough I'm at full disclosure, I ain't got no closure Only want you closer, baby I'm a loner Boy, you can give me everything I'ma still cut the string I'ma still cut the string I ain't got no anchoring, I ain't got no anchoring Sorry I am angering you I ain't got no anchoring, I ain't got no anchoring Sorry I am angering you Picture this photo books, where remembering is the key ingredient. Preserving memories, keeping the memories of your loved ones alive as they reach in and touch your heart. How beautiful your mother looked at her wedding, and even more so at yours. The holidays are coming. What better time to give a gift of remembrance that makes you laugh and cry all at the same time. Whether it's a gift of past holidays, grandma's recipes, long ago moments, or just because, those smiles and tears will melt your heart. Call Karen Shaw at 646-798-0809. Once again, that's 646 646- 798-0809 or visit picturethisphotobooks.com Hey everybody, my name is Forbes Riley and I'm an American actress and a TV host and I was delighted when I got my copy of Missing which is Extraordinary Relation of Ordinary People based on a real life relationship 
it's just, it's well written. It's amazing. You know, it talks about a man who has lost his wife and his daughter, and it's very well done. I'm going to highly recommend that you go get your copy of Missing. It is a powerful, exciting read. Mr. Mian Moshe Zia. He is the author of Missing. And I want to give a big shout out and a kiss all the way halfway around the world to my dear friend. Check him out at Mia's website. It's called www.miamotionzea.com. Missing, available on Amazon. Again, I'm Forbes Riley, and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye. The Mike Wagner Show is powered by Sonic Web Studios. If you're looking to start or upgrade your online presence, visit www.sonicwebstudios.com for all of your online needs. Sonic Web Studios specializes in custom web design, app development, social networking, search engine optimization, domain registration, email marketing, online stores, and more. Since our birth, we have been designing and developing immaculate websites and providing web solutions which are a cut above the rest. As a leading web designing enterprise, we have a team of extremely talented web designers designers who are well focused and have the experience of working on multiple web developing platforms such as PHP, Magento, Custom WordPress and more. Sonic Web Studios has been helping businesses of all kinds whether big, small, established or startup impress their audiences with exemplary web solutions. We don't just create beautiful and functional websites, we give you a complete online solution with the main goal of enhancing your yearly revenues. We aim to give your business the online exposure and brand acknowledgement that will help you in achieving and increased conversions leading to profitable sales. Call 1-800-303-3960 or visit us online at www.sonicwebstudios.com to get started today. Mention the Mike Wagner Show and get 20% off your project. Sonic Web Studios, take your image to the next level. Thanks for listening to the Mike Wagner Show powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. The Mike Wagner Show can be heard on Spreaker, Spotify, iHeartRadio, iTunes, YouTube, Anchor FM, Radio Public, and themikewagnershow.com. Please support our program with your donations at themikewagnershow.com. Join us again next time for another great episode of The Mike Wagner Show.